Hello and welcome to another episode of Coffee Fusion. This week we're going to look at the little guy. Hey guys, so a couple of years ago now I released a video on the little guy, the uh, stovetop espresso maker, which is like a remake of the Atomic Espresso Maker. So I thought what I'd do is play around with the little guy a little bit more, now that I know more about extraction compared to when I made that last video. So in the last video, I just used the preset uh, little guy button and that has its own program for extraction. But this time I thought I'd play around with the manual settings and see how I could get the most out of my coffee. So I started with a base recipe of 21 grams of clickbait um, and thought I would kind of um, set some parameters around extraction using what I know about extraction to kind of try and get the best out of it and uh, play around with things from there. But first of all, if you don't know the little guy, basically what it is is a stovetop espresso maker. So you provide a heat source at the bottom there's a little boiler in the bottom of it that heats up and extracts coffee. And there's also a steam arm so that you can steam milk as well. Um, with the uh, little guy, if you get things uh, really, really nice, there's plenty of steam pressure um, to texture really silky milk and you can get some great extractions as well. I found I got the best results when I went straight to full um, temperature, so setting number five, and used that to get some really nice energy building up in the uh, espresso maker. And so compared to the preset, this is a quicker build up. Um, the extraction starts at the six minute mark as opposed to the eight minute mark with that preset button. And the general rule of thumb for extraction um, was about the 45 second mark. I was actually pulling the shots a little bit longer, so taking about a minute to get through the extraction. And in that time, I found that the uh, extraction was still running nicely. But after a minute with that sort of temperature, things started to get out of hand really quickly. So basically after one minute, I'd pull the cup out, um, just measure the weight and see what the, uh, the yield was. And then I'd steam the milk straight away. Now with the little guy, I was getting some really, really tasty coffees, and I mean comparable to the espresso machine um, tasting coffees. When I was extracting uh, with all those variables, a yield of about 30 to 35 grams. Um, pushing to 40 was okay, but much past 40 um, was a little bit um, iffy. And for those of you who don't know the little guy at all, you can certainly get some really good milk and uh, extractions as I was saying, which means you can pour some really cool latte out as well. So there you go guys, that's my uh, advanced guide on the little guy. I'd um, like to know what you think of it, if you've seen the little guy before and had a chance to play with it. If you have a recipe of your own, just put that in the comments below or perhaps you can try my recipe and see what you think. And if this is your first Coffee Fusion video, basically Coffee Fusion is a community. What we do is a lot of YouTube videos and education on coffee, um, anything coffee related. So if you like this video, make sure you do click that like button, but then click subscribe so you can see the new videos as they come through. And if you didn't know, we also have a roastery which is attached to the YouTube channel. So it's a really cool and different kind of way of um, buying your coffee. Um, there's lots of specialty coffee to buy. If you have any questions about coffee at all, put them in the comments or send me an email or whatever, and I'll get straight back to you. In the meantime, if your hopper's looking a little bit empty and you're living within Australia, head to coffeefusion.com.au and grab your next coffee from us. Thanks guys, if you have any other coffee related questions, chuck them in the comments below and that could be a video next week. Otherwise, I'll see you later. Bye.